We're back for day two and I've got my Hyperia shirt. But yeah, we're still outside stealth waiting for it to open. We're literally about to run off to the swarm and then it started testing, so we're gonna give it a bit. They just opened the queue and everyone ran. So we're about to go on stealth first train of the day. So we've just done three rides on stealth in 15 minutes. Front, middle and back. And the airtime on that is mental. The launch is amazing. The third, the third, um, third time, it felt like we're gonna roll back. It's on 20 minutes now. Okay, our beer is on a hundred, so we're going to see how long the single ride is. Empty. Let's go. There's the what the the board of fame. I I know two of them, which is Mac and Early Magic Making. Jam. Do they do the construction? I see them fences yeah. sometimes. I think. Out of row nine, same seat as yesterday, and <laughs> insane again. Whipped over every element, still solid number one. Single rider took about half an hour, so we saved 70 minutes there. Yeah, that was one of the best rides I've had on it. Second best, because last night, same seat, but it had a chance to warm up. Definitely do single rider, save you a lot of time. We were on the same train. He was we on were. Six. I was on row six. It was good. Need um, to get you on the back. Mm. And I need it, to get on the front. Yeah, um, it's... Not the smoothest thing. It wasn't. But well, I, I don't mind. It's not like unbearable. No, not at all. And it's not um, bad. No. It, I it, think it adds to the intensity. Yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna get some cool photos. So there's another reminder to follow me on Insta. Single riders up to here. Oh, there's berries up there, though. Yeah. Let's see how long it takes. So in the end it took 35 minutes to get on instead of 60 so there's proof single rider's amazing. I was on the front row though, and that was a lot rougher than yesterday. My friend was on the front yesterday, 
and he said it was rough but he went on the back today and he said it was fine so maybe the front is rougher <laughs> yeah really head banging but the indoor bit is really cool anyway I don't know what ride we're doing we're in Zodiac because we've never done a Enterprise before let's see see how this goes so we just did Zodiac and that was actually okay Yeah, Zodiac was very good. That's my thoughts. We're probably going to do Rush now. We have just had KFC. And whilst we're in it, four out of the six major coasters closed. Ten minute wait. Walking Dead is just open, so we're not doing rush, we are getting straight to Walking Dead. So we've just done Walking Dead. There wasn't as many actors in there as I thought there'd be, there was like two. Yes. But, yeah, I like the actors, he doesn't. I'm just a wuss. Okay. The actual coaster itself was cool, like how it stopped on the blocks and then starts like trying to go forward and keeps like stopping suddenly. But yeah, it's really well themed. Uh, good ride. It's on an hour now, but we've ran to it straight away, so we've gotten it in like 10 minutes. Abandoned Samurai. Hyperius testing. open that was such a calm opening the security like made sure no one few jumped <laughs> row seven took about 15 minutes let's go So we got row seven, didn't we? No, not, we didn't. Not, Liar. Yeah. Oh well. Not as whippy as row nine. To do samurai. What? Yeah, just do it. <laughs> yeah, single round is empty, so. And just like that, that is one of my favourite flat rides in the UK. It was really good. One minute you're going slow and then you just get whipped round a corner. Very good. And there's really good hang time on it. Uh oh. <laughs> Jackie can get wet in the queue line. I'm pretty sure it's on one boat, so. Is that where the queue's up to? Oh my god. Is that even 20 minutes? I'm bone dry. I'm rather soggy. The drop was fun though. And then we got to the bottom of the drop, we hit the water, nothing came on us, and then all of a sudden it's like 10 bathtubs are dumped on you. Um, actually it's 2.7. 2, 2.7. 2 anyway, we're going to dry off on stealth. How long did that take? Like, uh, 20 minutes. Maybe, I don't know. So we just done row three, it took about half an hour. It, I could tell it had warmed up. Uh, I screamed somewhere down the launch. 
to a demonstration. Just put the audio in. Very good airtime, especially on that break run. You just get pushed into your, like, throw forward in your seat. Anyway, Swarm's on 30, so I think we'll try and go do the Swarm. Uh-oh. It's coming. I hope we are fine here. We had on it yesterday. Very forceful. It's just too short. I was gonna take a photo, but I don't got enough time, so I'll do it on the next one. But yeah, that drop is amazing. Hanging over the hill. Zero G rolls, very good. And then the the oh, I forgot what that element's called. The banked loop. And then. The, the roll over the station, the inline twist is very hand -time. Inline. Yeah. Anyway, that's Swarm for you. The theming is probably second best or first in the UK. I don't know. I think I like Nemesis more. But Nemesis just has the big eye. This has it. Um, this has it everywhere. So maybe this. Do you, are you no, saying yeah, the Nemesis? the best themed coaster in the UK. I think this actually. Nemesis isn't even top three. What? <laughs> Bro, what are you talking about, man? Ops and odds. I'm gonna end that one there. That was good, but it's too short. You get like two good swings. And the air, the air time is good though. But yeah, that's rush done. <laughs> Possibly Hyperion eh? Uh oh, not again. I'd say that go on it was better than the last one. Because I got more hang time on that one. Very good ride. Probably my second favourite flat ride in the UK. Actually no. Top five. There you go. What? What would say Ben? Maelstrom. Anyways, I don't know what we're doing next. Stealth on 15. 15 for stealth. 100 minutes, so we're gonna go and see what it is like. Single rider. Um, um, it's quite far up the stairs. Oh no, it's not. Oh, no. We're going to see what single rider is like. Five second walk through. All oh, the price tags are like... Saw the ride resin. Where is there a saw the ride resin? No, that's the, the ride Billy resin. Oh, I didn't have it. It. Cool, should we go on so 25 and he bought a thing. 
for a change. I bought a Hyperia t-shirt, which you've already seen, and then I bought a stealth pillow because it's just a big tire and I want to throw it around. Throw a tire to people. Yeah, this looks good. Let's see how long it takes. <laughs> Look how much you can see on that. That was very rough. And the actual ride is pretty good. Oh, I'm too close. The airtime on Saw is better than the airtime on Smiler. Bye guys. Do you agree? Oh, see you later. See you later. Second row. station was just empty so they sent like half a train of single riders yeah, which is i mean that was the smoothest ride i've had on it on paper it looks bad but it works out well for people like us let's say yeah single rider is op solid number one he's literally just been to florida done iron quasi and velocicoaster and he says this is better than it that's how good this is and how have we got this in the uk i i can't understand Thank you for watching. Hyperia is insane. Thought Park is insane. We may possibly be back. That doesn't end this trip though. It ends Thought Park. I'm sad. Not for long though. 
Uh, we're going to go to Legoland Windsor for about two hours tomorrow to get the coaster credits and just to explore it because I've never been. But yeah, thanks for watching, leave a like and sub and I'll leave you with a special end screen of Hyperion.